Oh, no, never. He's almost constantly in his laboratory. Laboratory? Yes. He's fixed over his father's own one, you know. He's deep in some experiment. I see. What sort of experiment? I'm sure I don't know. Now, we're going to be hooking a DALI bus monitor across the DALI bus just as if it was any other device on the bus. Hi, Bob Shearer here. And the question, what did the light switch say to the light bulb, is not so much a riddle, but a very genuine question in a DALI system. What is this switch putting out? Now, on the DALI bus, I've connected both our LED dimming module and I'm plugged into the USB port of an old uh, XP desktop that's running Tridonix DALI bus monitor. So let's just go ahead and open that program. There it is, DALI monitor version 2.5. And make this a little bigger so we can see it. And I'm just going to hit the switch and it says direct dark power 100% and our lights have come up 100%. Now I can step through the different stages that the switch allows by hitting the button. Now I have a 76% arc power and I have a 51% arc power and I have a 26% arc power and I can rotate back to a 100% arc power and hit it off. So that's what the light switch is saying to the light bulbs. Uh, very interesting. Um, so it also answers a question about is this uh, rocker a dimming rocker and the answer is no. The rocker itself does not issue dimming commands. However, our slider does, and when we move it, we should see a whole bunch of commands popping out, and that's from the slider. So there you have it. I found the little clear the buffer command, so I can go ahead and issue a bunch of commands, and if I don't want them cluttering up the screen, I can knock it back off. So this is interesting, uh, arc power zero, or broadcast off. You'll note these are all broadcast commands. I doubt if you can see it, but they will affect everything on the DALI bus. And speaking of the DALI bus, what happens if we lose it? Our lighting comes up full, that's programmed in the driver module. And if I turn it back on, we'll see that this switch upon power up automatically puts out a 100% command to bring the lights on. Uh, this is what I'm actually doing in my garage. I'm using one of these in the garage and when an aux sensor hots up the system it turns the lighting on to 100%. Once again slider just issues commands like crazy when you slide the little dimming slider up and down. So very, very interesting widget, and it allows you to see what's going on on most digital buses that are controlling uh, drivers or ballasts directly.